Hello everybody, I'm Nate Asher, and welcome back to Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Wind Waker HD. In the last episode, we finally, finally got the Swiss Sail. And in this episode, we are going to be going around and placing these uh, pearls where they go on the map. Let's see, one is going to be right below us. And now we have the Swift Sail, we can just go right there. We don't even have to uh, reset the wind, so pretty cool. Um, which also means, hopefully, this will be, um, one of the last times that I'll have to cut, because we're going to get to our destination in a lot less time. So, one is going to be right over here. There's going to be a lot of these Octoroks, like, garden. I'm pretty sure they're going to guard all the, uh, things. That right there is the, uh, Cyclone that Cyclos is typically at. Um, it's almost right in the middle. It's the block right south of, uh, Windfall. So if you ever need to get Cyclos right away, and you just want to get the song and you already have the bow, um, that's where he is. All right, so first up is Din. You place Din's pearl on the ancient statue's hands. Two pearls remain. Okay. Next one is going to be this way. If we can avoid this, okay, good. I don't have the bow, and I'm not trying to rewatch that cutscene. I'm not sure why it's getting dark and stormy all of a sudden. I don't think this is for any uh, story event. I think this is just normal storminess. I like how they added, like, if you look at the sails, the swift sail, not only is it a different color, but it's got, like, a little bit more oomph. See those oomphs? Coming off there. <laughs> hey, look, it's the, uh, uh, what do they call those? The Salvaging Brothers. Alright, so now we got Feyroar. Place Favor's Pearl in the Ancient Statue's hand. One pearl remains. Kind of reminds me of like playing Halo as a kid, and there's always like five minutes remaining. I'm playing on like split screen and everything, me and my brothers. Alright, guys, just one more. Ugh. If I see any fish, I'll go ahead and feed them, but I kind of gave up on uh, deliberately going around and feeding fish, like that's, we got uh, some stuff to do. Alright, so it should be just like a little bit further this way. It's almost like right in the middle. 
should come into um, rendering distance here in about five, four, three, two, one. There's a fish. I'll go ahead and get him. Oh, wait, I have some bait. Where you go? I was really lucky. I hit that thing at the exact same time you hit me. Oh, you small fry. Yeah, yeah, I've heard. I take it you want chart and information about this island? Then start by opening up your sea chart. Famed photographer lives far to the north on, of here on Windfall Island. He apparently real wise and talented in the ways of pictography. He's even said to have legendary photographs that he treasures above all other things. He keeps them hidden away in a secret safe, or so they say. By the way, small fry, what exactly is a pictograph anyway? That's all the info I've got to offer. When you hear it again, you'll have to throw some bait. Can't fight evil on an empty stomach. Well, ain't that just the truth. All right, now Nehru. I was going to blow up. Hmm. Oh, it did blow up. tower which the pearly gods have caused to appear as a place that the gods of the ancient world prepared so that it might test the courage of men. Only one who is able to overcome the trials that await here will be acknowledged by the gods to be a true hero. Only then will that hero be permitted to wield the power to destroy the great evil. Link, that which you must obtain now lies before you. You must believe in your own courage which has led you to triumph over many hardships you have faced, and you must triumph once again. You must rise above the trial of the gods. All right. All right, guys, so here's the difference. I just realized that my game audio, for some reason, is capturing. Um, we're not going to take on this fire dungeon in this episode. I'm going to hopefully have this fixed by the next episode, but I do want to show off a speedrun trick to skip the whole
full dungeon anyway. At least half of it. But in the next episode, whenever I do get the audio fixed, hopefully, um, I'm going to take on the dungeon in its entirety. Just in case you need um, instructions on that and don't want to cheat. I always think it's fun to do this though, so I'm just gonna do it. But up here. Okay, so what you wanna do pick up one of these statues. And get on here. You're gonna face the wall. Okay. And you're going to use DR, drop it. Now, you're going to face this. Well, you don't talk to the hand red lines. What you want to do, you want to do a backflip, and while you're in the air still, like as quick as you can, hit the leaf button. And then when you do that, you're going to want to immediately hit A to let go, so you grab the ledge. Might take you a few tries. Do that. Fall off the ledge. You want to go like this, go all the way to the wall, back up, right above the statue. So you should be falling and your hand should hold onto the corner like this. So if you're not like this, then repeat the last steps until you get to this point. Now what you want to do is you're going to move the analog stick to the left, but you're going to Link is going to move right, and that's how you'll know you did it right. So I'm going to move left, Link moves right, That's it. so I know I did it right. Now what you want to do, get up to stand up, and now you should be standing in this void here. Yeah, I popped into the, uh, the map again. So what you want to do, that again, one more time, get left, you're gonna move, you're going to stand up, and then going... Try and jump behind this pole. Once you do this, easy sailing, no pun intended. Fly around here, and you're going to go right for that mouth. Wait till the, the waves move us back up. Before we drown, come on. Move this way. Oh, did I? There we go. Should pop in right here. And then you don't have to do any of those side rooms that open up that water. But we're going to do that anyway in the next episode. So hope you guys enjoyed this little uh, speed run tactic. And uh, sorry again about the audio. I'm going to try and get that fixed. I'm going to talk to my buddy uh, Yami Pajami on Twitch. If you don't know, or do I haven't watched him, go check him out. Uh, I'll put a link down in the description for his Twitch channel. But, um, yeah, so I might uh, get together with him to see if we can figure out what's wrong with it. But, uh, anyway, thank you guys for watching this episode. If you enjoyed, please leave a like, and I will see you in the next one. Thanks. Bye.